we are the ones that want to make this a priority in our lives. So, you know, ultimately we want to play music. Yeah. Like we've all made concessions and or uh, improvements in our life to be able to be, be able to do this. Without being morbid, what do you think he did? What was his accident? Well, he was working with windmill without a water wheel that wasn't pumping. Mm. He had uh, much wind, and then usually he... he so uh, had no resistance? No, and yeah. it was ice. And when there is ice, we don't pump the water because it's dangerous when there is a hollow space right, can below. Uh, right. but yes, and then when they pumped the water out of there, it came here, and uh, pretty quick the water rise and it probably made the water wheel turn probably in the wrong in the other direction. direction. And because it's disengaged. Yeah. yeah, and there he had to do something and, and there it went wrong. And what exactly went wrong, well, that's not very clear. Actually, that's the reason you all are here, so. Yeah. yeah. To be honest, we had an idea of that, but we didn't realize that it was so fresh. Yeah, yes, it is. Okay. Very fresh. And it was a good friend. Months? That's what I'm saying. Yeah, so, yeah. I mean, not that we were not taking it serious and like of course. Felt, no, no. Feel, feeling the honor around it. Yeah. But I think I can speak for us. I don't think any of us knew that it was so recent. Yeah. I, th I thought from just our emails oh, that it was yeah. like maybe a year or two ago. Yeah, no, you know? no. And then so last I, night I think was really you will experience that on Thursday. I think your concert will be a kind of requiem yeah. for Ornate. Yeah. yeah. Well, for oh. me personally, I'm hoping that it's like. Um, uh, a new start. Well, basically, the band was started by some guys who enjoyed listening to old time music and old country music and traditional folk music. And um, we decided to play that kind of music, you know. Ward and I were friends for about 20 years. He was in college. <clears throat> I stole his girlfriend. Uh -huh. And then we got in the then we got in the rock and roll band together. <laughs> and then here we are. And then I knew Ben in high school when he was about 16, 17 years old. And Ferd I met uh, in Telluride, Colorado, right? Pretty much. Yeah. And, uh, and then Brian I knew from Charlottesville. So we kind of started in Charlottesville, Virginia in a way. I was gonna say there is a spirit in this music that we've all recognized, and um, we like to keep that spirit going. But you can take this music anywhere, and people seem to just be able to like relate to it. It's very disarming. We played this music because we like it, because it's because it also like seems to bring a lot of happiness. Like a bird about twice 
Touch your brother on your right side. Touch your chest. 